Alright, welcome back everybody. Welcome back to the Mulfog Project. And today we're going to be working on, well, you know, the Mulfog. Bleh. Of course. <laughs> it's important. Uh, uh, let's see where it is. There it is. So yeah, today we're going to be working on this. And now we just need to wait for it to go. <sighs> so the main, so the main issue that I have currently is that uh, it's a little bit getting too hot outside. <laughs> also, people are having over. It's like, uh, it's a all right. So um, yeah, it has been way too hot. Technically, I should have done this like seven o'clock at night time, but that doesn't work because otherwise I will have sweaty hands and I will burn my own hands, and uh, that is a very problematical thing to have happening. So for had happening, half happening, yeah, probably. So we're gonna be today. We're gonna be working on this bad boy, and hopefully, you know, I won't be able to burn my hand off. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna be working on this again. Um, so where did we left off? That's normally the biggest choice. Come on. Give me an idea where I left off. Alright. Left off here. Great. Alright. So, um, that happens, you know. The amount of stuff that I need to do, you know, I could not do, I could not plan for this, that it it, it would be that hot again this year, but uh, yeah, it is hot enough to make sure that I'm not able to get working on my drawings in the, in the, la in the later at night. Because of all the, mo because I, I'm living in a moisture, because it is like highly moisture, uh, the heat actually stays. Which is a very problematical thing to have happening. Or well, that is happening. Yeah, very problematical thing that is happening. Not half. Uh, English. So, uh, yeah. Now, of course, you know, I have been busy also with other things in my mind, and therefore, you know, I had a little bit of problems uh, getting this uh, up and running again. But uh, it's alright, you know, it's alright. So after uh, um, after tomorrow, uh, after t uh, from uh, from this day again, you know, till I think end of summer, summer probably, I will be able to. Uh, uh, yeah, until the end of the summer, I w I will be uh, doing this because I'm a little bit uh, because I want to make sure that I can be do and that I'm continuing with this drawing. But if the summer is again so hot, then uh, so hot and moisture, you know, things with like sweating won't work. Therefore, you know, you're gonna be burning your own hand on the tablet, which is a problem. And uh, we don't want that problem. We don't want to have my. Ha I don't want my hand to get burned. That is uh, the least favorite thing I would have to have happening. Yeah, that is the right wording. So uh, yeah, um, working on this bad boy for today. One hour, and then after that, after that, we will see what we're gonna do. Then this is the, then this is the, uh, then this is the, um, let's see, this is the, no, what, 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 that's the grass, that's the grass, that's the grass. First, then the part that we need. Uh huh. All right. So no, not this one. We need the other one. We need to go to this one. Yes. Which one is it? This one. All right. Cool. So the main issue that we have, you know, today 
is that I need to be working again and uh, I am mean not working for two days because of reasons on my own self. I'm still waiting for the call though, which is quite of a problematical thing, you know. I I am a very strict person when it comes to calls. Uh, when somebody says, I will call you today, it is always very nice for me to have that person be calling me. Otherwise, I will be like, oh, what? You're not calling? That is, uh, uh, let's see. No. Ah, yes. i put this to 75, just to make sure that I am able to see what I'm drawing. There you go. Find the right, find, find the right answer. Now we can be drawing on this. So if we draw now, that will work, right? Yes. All right. Good. Now making sure that I have the right amount of size on this bad boy, and we can start. So yeah, um, the mo the most in the most problematical thing that I came across. Um, it's like you know, if if you have like something that is important, and then you know you make an appointment upon that, it is very important that you know you live to your uh, thing. Like you know, y you said you would do this, then well, you probably are not going to be saying, oh well, I kind of forgot, and uh, I'm not going to be doing that, because that's not very good, because of all the stuff that can happen. Uh, if you don't do it, so if you are doing something like doing the dishes and then you don't do the dishes, then the dishes will be staying there for like an hour. And then somebody else is coming home and says like, "What the hell? Why didn't you do the dishes? You said you wanted to do the you said you do the dishes, and then you know you didn't do the dishes, so you cannot have a spoon today." So you're missing out on the beautiful uh, uh, putting. No, oh. you ah, all right. Do it.
There you go. Blech. 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 All right. Um, that was a telephone call. <laughs> Very important one, actually. Um, so uh, I have some good news. <laughs> yes. What a surprise. I have good news. Wow. All right. So uh, I have some good news. Uh, I. I. Uh, uh, I, uh, I got the job, woo! So, uh, yeah, um, so, in two week time, I believe two weeks from now on, uh, uh, two weeks from here, uh, I'm gonna be on Monday, I'm gonna be going to my job, uh, to my workplace, where I'm gonna be working. So, uh, that's gonna be lovely. Also, I'm gonna be then finally using the dreaded most difficult thing I ever came across, namely the uh, uh, train. Yeah, uh, I have problems with trains. They, they 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 look they are tall, fast, you know all that stuff. So uh, yeah, <laughs> sorry up uh, sorry for abrupting uh, uh, rem uh, putting my mic off, but uh, it is important that uh, you know. It, uh, private private conversations are very important to talk about, and you know, Dutch is a very complicated language, and well, you know, live streaming and getting on a phone. Well, technically, the phone is more important than live stream. So, yeah, I was not expecting it to be this early. I was expecting i i had i had a i had a i had i was expecting that there was something caught between it. So that's why, you know, I was waiting for the phone call to come, but the phone call didn't come. And, um, uh, I was right. Um, they are, the, the company that I'm, uh, that I applied for was really busy, busy, busy work. So they had like a really busy schedule. Therefore, they were not able to, uh, they actually promised to, you know, say, hey, we're gonna call you tomorrow. And, that was a mistake on their part because they they realized like oh my god uh, <laughs> we kind of forgot so yeah it was not possible to call back that day but because I'm a bloody damn artist it uh, oh ah, did it did it all right hold on I need to switch this out to yep uh, because I'm a bloody damn artist, I always take these things not lightly. It's like, mm, yes, you promise something and then you don't, pr and then you don't follow up to it. That is a promise that you cannot hold, and then therefore, you know, it is not. Pro it's a thing that uh, you know I always take. I I know that it is wrong to do that way of you know thinking like <gasps> you promised and then you know you didn't come, you didn't follow through, but uh, yeah. I'm learning that as well, just making sure that, you know, I, I have respect if somebody forgets something, I'm just, you know, pointing it out, I'm pointing out their mistake, but not punishing them for it, because, you know, everybody has, everybody has a good reason to, you know, do stuff like that. Unless it is deliberately done, then no, then, then it's not, but this one was, ex uh, this one was accidental. They underestimated the time. They underestimated the, the busy schedule, so therefore, you know, they forgot how to do properly. Alright, so as you can see, we're almost done with this part of the rocks, and then we're going to move on to the, the these parts, and then that's how you do it. And that's how we do it. Mm -hmm. Alright, now we're going to go to light. So, yeah, the... Um, uh, the news is uh, very good. I got a job. That means that I'm probably not be able to draw all the time because you know then it needs to be done. Uh, I need to be then on the move already because it is like a long journey. It's like I think 50 kilometers. Yeah, 50 kilometers of uh, distance between work and my home place, which means that uh, it's either you know doing the doing that day the live stream really early like. Six o'clock, but it's technically that's not even possible. Technically, I need to be awake six o'clock. Then I need to do my. Then I need to go on my bike at seven o'clock. No, no, no. I need to be on my bike then, and then I need to go to the train station, and then I need to be arriving there at eight o'clock. So that means that six o'clock, seven o'clock, eight o'clock. So I only have one hour of 
distance. So it's like 7 o'clock waking up, getting my breakfast in my mouth and then move on while ri riding my bike and then go to the go to the nearby place. The main issue is then probably that uh, I need to make sure that I have my uh, uh, how do you say the uh, boop, 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 the bus I also need to use. Ugh. I need to use a lot of things. I need to use the bus, I need to use the train, and then, I, and then I'm finally there. So, if I'm correct, it is one hour of... I, I, if I'm correct, it's one and a half hour of uh, journey, but... Eh, I'm probably not fully correct on that one. On that part, but... Let's hope I am. Anyway, so, uh, yeah. Um, so, from that... Uh, so... Uh, in two week times, I will be doing my excellent, uh, excellent best to do my work properly, and then, you know, go from there on. Uh, this it all it all has to do with 3D modeling, so don't worry about it. It is like you know a job that I like. It's not a job that I don't like. It's not working at McDonald's. <laughs> Otherwise, I would not have been so excited. <laughs> oh sh! God dang it! Mm. I'm doing this on the wrong layer. Again! God dang it. I'm always... I'm always hating this when I realize that I'm doing it on the wrong layer. It's like, oh wait, what? It's still a mistake that I still need to realize. Like, oh well, you have a mistake. Yes, you made a mistake with the coloring and therefore, you know, now you need to do this. So, the main issue that I'm always facing with these kind of color... Uh, with these uh, kind of effects, the... Um, the uh, oh, the dr uh, the effects that I'm trying to do because you know I I actually finished another drawing for my uh, project. Uh, whereas I have problems with the positioning and the coloring of the background because you know you need to have the same background as the one beforehand so that it is compatible towards the art style. So, because I'm using the same model as the hat model of that artwork, it was like, you know, a very difficult one to do because you need to figure out like, oh well, I use these colors, I use these color schemes, so I need to use those color schemes again. Then I reused one of my assets as well, uh, the skull on the hat, and I used the skull in a big form, and I need to make sh and I needed to make sure that that skull also represent the um how do you say that uh represent the stuff that I had so it was a lot of forward and backward of realizing like oh well I'm doing this I'm doing this I'm doing this and now I'm doing this and this and this so uh where where am I now at the point of view because I wanted to make sure that this was looking like an action, alright? It was like, yeah! I'm gonna throw a big giant fireball at your face, and you are gonna like it. That kind of action. Of course, you know, that is a very difficult thing to pull off, yes, but... Uh, by... Uh, by... Um, how do you say that? By... Uh, making sure that I'm doing the... Uh, by... yeah by looking into the original picture and then figuring out like oh well it is like this or it is like that I figured out how to get it from point A to point B and uh, it, it turned out pretty great I, I, must, uh, I must say I, I liked it and I liked how I did the spot print uh, I liked how I did the spotting so the um, uh, making jokes making 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 fun out of something like you know, putting some uh, some terrible advi uh, putting some advice in there that is like, yeah, it is relatable, but it is not relatable at most cases. So it's like you know, having to talk and then boom, it's not gonna be there. I mean, obviously, you know, probably this this stream is gonna be the wor worst stream I ever did because of all the you know abrupt endings, like hey, and then book, everything is silent. It's like no. Also, people walking in. Yeah, 
you know, I'm still living in a somebody, I'm still living in my own room at my parents' house, so yeah, people walk in all the time, because my door is not locked, because I cannot lock my door. It is one of those things that you cannot lock. It is, uh, it's a door that is not lockable, and that is a very nasty door, because, you know, you don't, you don't want to have a door that is not lockable. Trust me, it is, it's, 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 it's really annoying. Of course, you know, because the door is not lockable, the amount of stuff, uh, let's see, the amount of stuff that has been done, of, well, the door is not lockable because of all the, uh, because of the hazard, yes, the hazard of the, uh, amount of stuff that can be happening. Um, so yeah, I cannot lock my door, and it is very sad, I know. But it is good. It's good that I have. Uh, uh, it is good that I have a door that cannot be locked. All right. It's good I have that. As you can see, I now finish this part up. Now we're gonna be looking at what what we're gonna put here in the background because I'm like feeling like there needs to be something. It needs to be something, but I don't know what. Probably more rocks though, but. Ugh. So, we're going to be looking at that. This is a sketch. This is a sketch. Oh, lovely. Alright, we have the sketch. And now we're going to be looking at something like, I don't know. Put this sketch down. We're just going to be looking at a sketch. So, if we put a rock right here. That's green. That's not a rock. If I'm using green, that's a terrible option for this. Alright. So now I can see like what I want to do. So if I want to have a new rock, I can put a rock right... I can put a new rock right here. If I put a rock right here, would that solve anything? Would that solve a problem that I'm already having? Would that solve it? The main issue with the rocks is like you know you want you want to put those rocks down, but you don't want to you don't want to create this effect that you know is a very problematical thing. So if we put like a rock right here, that would work. Yes, that would work. So one rock here is good enough to clean up this big place. And now we're gonna be looking here. So we need to have a rock right here, but we need to have um, do, 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 do. Well, I'm gonna put a rock right here as well. So one rock right here, and then nothing here, and then and then one rock here that would work, and then have this part right here open. So put it like this. So one rock here and one rock there, and put this rock right so. All right. So um. Now we're at the place that we want to do. Yes, now we want to do these these things. Gotta put this on low again, and now fifty, sixty, sixty. Do you look better than taking it? Ja, leuk hè? Nee, 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 nee. Gewoon een mof, hoor. Gewoon een mof. Groot ding, though. Nog steeds groot. Met heel veel stenen. Ja. Mm -hmm. Zeker. As you can see, the rocks amount. As I told you, I, my door is not locked. People can walk in. And the the how do you say this the cleaning yeah the cleaning lady is now here as well so and you know you need to be nice to people oh that's a big size that's not that's not allowed and I need to move this to create effect all right I need to create a rock effect that is the main issue.
That is probably a good one to go for, but I need to have more. Like so, and then put this downwards, I believe. Like so, and then that should increase the amount of stuff in the rock. There you go. Alright, now we're going to be looking at the color. Because we are going to be working with color as well. Because we want to have this rock to be colored up. Um, so I'm going to be doing this very, very cautiously. We don't want to leave anything behind and also we don't want to ruin the other drawing. Because if we're ruining it, it is not good. But you can see now already how this is going to be working out. Also this is like what I need to be worried about, like where and how am I going to put this rock down. So this rock looks like this. And we don't want that, we want to make sure that the rock actually looks decent. So how do we do that? Well now we have the color so we can now figure out like, oh well, we know now how to draw this, so we're going to be, you know, putting the rock to its place. Like so. Yep, there you go. Easy. And then I need to put some more grass right here to make sure that the uh, lining up of the rocks is properly done. And how how hot is it already? And it's already 30 degrees. God damn it. This is why I cannot have nice things, trust me. If I had nice things I would have already told you that I had them. But uh, the amount of, you know, bullshit that is happening right now with the moisture is insane. I'm already sweating like an ox, so you know, it's uh, it's it's uh, it is good to know that it is summer. But uh, these summers here, they're not summers. They're literally moisture fests of moisture. Yeah, there you go. Good, good, good. A good wording of you know how how bad the uh, how yeah yeah how bad the amount of uh, moisture is actually here. Yeah. I was quite of surprised how much problems the the moisture actually can get me, but oof, ugh. it's a very problematical thing to have happening. Of oh, have happening, is happening. Yeah, probably that's the right word. Now we're gonna be putting this down, and now we're gonna be doing the murder part, so we don't ruin everything. There you go. And that's how you do the rock. There you go. Now we can switch to the other side and fix those parts. Or we can go first put this grass better up. I think that's the I think that's the smarter move. This part, right? Yes. So now we're going to be switching back to the pencil, and then we're going to be switching back to pure black. And then we need to make sure that this is there. Uh, no, like almost. Yes, like that. Perfect. And we're going to be switching to the. Yep, yeah, and we're going to be switching to the grass, and we're going to be adding some more grass to it. Ah, well. I would have added some grass if I had not. Ugh. That's way too much. There you go. Lovely. Now we're gonna go to the grass part. Pull this up. Ah, I see.
I knew it. Alright, so now that we have this grass up and running, now we can add the other grass to it, and then we add that to it, and then that should fix everything. The main reason why I'm doing it right like this is to make sure that everything that I'm drawing is properly ordered. Because you know you want to re go back, go in, go back, go in, go back, go in, so everything is fine looking. And just like that, we filled up the bastard. Awesome. With no problems whatsoever. Well, some problems, but not all of it. Alright. Now we can take a look at where we leave. Where, 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 where do we leave here? Looks like there is a rock right here, a rock right there, and no rock there. So there is a rock right here, as you can see. And we're gonna put this all back into business, so we can see stuff. And we are gonna be drawing. We're not going to be drawing with green, that's horrible. We're going to be drawing with black, and we need to switch back to the pencil mode. <laughs> Alright, so, the idea here is that we're having like these two rocks right here, and probably we're going to be adding some parts here. So, these rocks, they're just rocks. It, it doesn't matter how you draw rocks, especially this one, this almost unrecognizable so it's not that difficult to draw correct like so and then this one supposed to be like so and then I wanna have a rock right here Huh. Now we need to fill it up again, just to get ourselves a good look at this, so that we know now how to... This is the main reason why I'm doing it like that, because I want to make sure that I'm not ruining anything here. Yeah, I'm not supposed to go for that color. I'm not supposed to go for that. I'm supposed to go for this color instead. Alright, now we can see what is going on here. Well, I see already some problems are occurring. So we want those we want those gone. Let's put it that way. These rough edges need to be gone. So now we can see like, alright, is this good enough? Is this looking decent? Well, it does look decent. God dang it. That's so evil. That's so evil. Always forgetting that that is working like that. So, as you can see, we need to have a darker color, so we should go for this one. And we should add that to our collection right here. There you go. And now we should have the blend tool as well. To And that's a rock. The only downside is that this part right here of the butterfly wing is a little bit different, but it's a doable rock. It's a doable rock. 
and we still want to have some more detail in this but we need to be doing this very precisely there you go and then I need to grab this one and that would fix it lovely alright so now we have done those rocks and now we are actually done for today I believe that's that's doable yeah. and that's a lovely rock alright cool so as you can see um, we have finished now this midsection so that we can now work towards the big giant tree trunk again uh, next day so um, I hope you all have enjoyed for today and uh, Sorry about all the uh, <laughs> things that are happening, but uh, you know, I am a busy man when it comes to things, so uh, I hope you will uh, all excuse me for it. And uh, I hope I'll see you all next time. Until then, I wish you all a lovely day. Bye!